What's up, family? <laughs> Y'all ready to get this conversation started? If you're joining me live, I appreciate you. Be up on the replay. Go ahead and hashtag replay. You know, guys, let me know where you're coming in from. Because I think tonight is really, really a hot topic. It's a hot topic that, uh, that I think we need to discuss. You know, we need to discuss this topic. Hello, everybody who's jumping on. I appreciate you guys. But I want to talk about expectations. You know, <laughs> guys, too many times we hold these high expectations. People have expectations from us. But expectation, it only leads to disappointments. Guys, we've been conditioned. We've learned to expect different things. People have learned to expect things from us. And when they don't turn out the way we think they should or the way we expect that they should, we get disappointed. We get angry. We get upset. Why? Because we expected something and didn't get the, and didn't get the result we expected. So we got to stop, you know, having these expectations of other people because everybody is going to have their experience. Everybody's going to have their perspective on, some, on, on the same issue. We all are different. We all going to have different perspectives. We're all going to see the, 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 the same situation differently. And when things don't turn out the way that we should, the way that we think that they should, we get all disappointed, get all upset because, oh, it didn't turn out the way it was supposed to turn out. Who said it was supposed to turn out any kind of way? It was your expectations that said it should turn out that way. When we attached, hey, April, hey, EA, I appreciate you, 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 you all jumping on. When we attach the word should Oh, my kids should do something. My parents should do this. Oh, my coworkers should do this. Oh, my teamwork should. Should, should, should. When we attach that word should, we're attaching an expectation. We're looking into the future of what should happen. And when it don't happen, what? We're not living in the now. We're living in the future because we're saying it should be this way. Who said it should be any kind of way? We're holding these expectations and of, of, of people, but their experience could be a whole lot different. Say something went, went differently for them and things didn't happen in your eyes the way it should be. I don't know guys we've just we've just been in this society and we've learned to expect different things and you know people hold these expectations of us that we should act the way that they think that we should act we should be a certain kind of person I mean have you ever been the person who have learned something and grew through an experience and you've changed, we all change every day. And then somebody says, oh, you've changed. Well, that was their expectation of you. You're not the same person they expected you to be. We got to quit expecting things from, from people. If you're going to do something, just do it without expectation. That way you won't be disappointed. You won't be discouraged or upset that, things didn't turn out the way that you thought it should. You know, for most of my life, you know, I live based on what other people's expectations of what I, sh what the kind of person that I should be, the actions that I should take, the, the things that, that I should have done in their eyes. When in fact, this is my life. Your life is yours. 
You do things based on what you feel. Grayson, hush. You do things the way that you feel they should be done. Not what people are expecting you, or that are expecting from you. Grayson, my dog, <laughs> he messing up my flow here. He messing up my flow. Yes, I've always found that to be dumb as, <laughs> as fuck when people say that that you've changed. You want me to stay complacent. Yes, yes. Grayson, enough. Come. Yes. I mean, people, people want you to stay the same person that you used to be. But if you've grown for the good, there's nothing wrong with that. And people have to realize that, accept that, because their expectations is their problem. What they expect you to do, that's, that's on them. What you can control is what you do. So stop having these expectations from people. Because it doesn't, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything except lead to more disappointment. Lead to disappointment after disappointment after disappointment. So stop having these expectations of people. People are going to do what the hell they want to do. So why shouldn't you? So what people expect you to act a certain way? If that ain't you, if that ain't how you feeling, why act that way? Because somebody expects you to do that. So... I just had to, you know, say that because it, it just it just drives me insane when people get upset when you didn't do what they expected you to do. <laughs> you know, and it and it, it does nothing for you except drive you insane when you're expecting something but getting a different result because you, your expectations of what was supposed to be didn't come the way you thought it should. So let's, let's lower your expectations. I mean, <laughs> matter of fact, don't have any expectations at all. Just do what you're going to do without <laughs> expecting anything in return. <laughs> Grayson, enough. Go. Enough. But do what you're going to do. I'm going to, um, I got to cut this a little short, but do what you, what you we're born to do. Be yourself. Be who you are. You know, live your life the way that you see fit. Not the way somebody else sees that you should be. Leave the damn word should out of your vocabulary. Because we don't have to do anything. Except be ourselves, be true to ourselves, follow our heart, and do what makes us happy. In order to live a happy life... Drop the expectations because as my girl Nicole said earlier, it does nothing but keep you stuck, keeps you unhappy, and just keeps you from being who you are because you're always living up to somebody else's standards. Set your own standards. Live up to your own standards because that's at the end of the day, that's what matters. That is what matters. So what you didn't do what somebody thought you should do? So what you don't act the way somebody think you should be acting? Who cares? You're the only one that, that matters here. As far as when it comes to your life, directing your life. Alright? So that's what I got for you guys tonight. Um, I had a whole lot more to say. My business meeting went a little bit longer than what I expected. So um, I'm running a little behind today. So I really hope you guys have a great night. Hope you guys got a little value from this. Um, maybe I'll go into the subject a little bit more. But I wanted to come on tonight because I said I was coming on at 9 o'clock tonight. But like again, I got to cut this a little bit short. But uh, anyway, you guys enjoy your night. I love you all. Let's drop these expectations that we have and uh, you know, live our best life. Because we deserve to live our best life. Alright guys. So you guys have a great night. 
Um, it's our time to be free.